the thoracic cavity basically starts here with the bones of the clavicles and ends in a muscle that we mentioned earlier today. What's the name of the muscle that goes through here? Diaphragm. Diaphragm. Okay. Basically, in all of our cavities, we have organs, and these organs are surrounded by an exterior layer. For example, the heart, an organ inside the thoracic cavity, is surrounded by an exterior layer or an exterior sac. What's the purpose of this sac? Protection. Okay, so we can say protection, but when you cut through bodies and try to find these sacs, it's a very, very thin sac. It's paper thin. So it doesn't give us much protection. Do you have another idea? Separation, maybe? From Between one and one. From liquids or other body parts. Okay, so it can separate or surround one organ. So for example, if we have an infection, it doesn't go to other places. That's one of the functions. But uh, an important function is basically to surround the organ because most of our organs move. For example, the heart moves all the time. And this exterior layer basically lubricates the movement of the heart.